The nation was plunged into a snap lockdown from 11.59pm last night, sparking a run on city supermarkets shortly after the Prime Minister's official announcement at 6pm. Pack and Save Gisborne owner Ewan Atherton said team members worked extra shifts yesterday and coped very well with the extra demand. Alert level 4 restrictions mean people must stay at home in their bubbles. They should only leave their homes for essential personal movement, including physical exercise in the neighbourhood, visiting the supermarket, dairy or pharmacy, necessary medical care or getting the COVID-19 test. Bramwell's Unicam Pharmacy is operating a closed-door policy as it did the previous Level 4 period with customers served at the door. Customer numbers were normal and there had been no huge lines, owner Grant Bramwell said. We serve everyone at the door, two metre, two metre spacing, um, accepting paperless scripts, you know, preferentially um, emailed, so um, hopefully not a lot of uh, paper copies. And yeah, just the usual precautions around hygiene and social distancing for the staff. Only hours before Alert Level 4 lockdown was ordered, Labour MP Mecca Whaiteri completed a round the election series of vaccination centre visits in Gisborne. All vaccination centres around the country are closed for 48 hours to ensure the safety of frontline medical staff. We talked to Riet Stoltz about the impact of the Level 4 lockdown. I do want to reassure our public all the services, the essential services, go ahead. Water, wastewater... Um, any issues you have there, just feel free to ring the council. Obviously, the library, the pool, the museum, um, all our theatres are closed. Under Level 4, all of those are closed. But um, dog control, stock control, all of those issues that might affect people out and about, not that we should be out and about, but we might be going for a little walk. Um, it is important that you know you can contact us and, and our phones are still being answered. <laughs>